Hi everyone, this is Natalie with SalonBusinessMarketingTools.com and today I want to share with you some ideas for some of the, what I think are the top seven cheap and easy ways to market your salon or spa business. A lot of times being a salon owner myself and then assisting other salon owners, I'm asked the question, how can I market my salon or get from behind the chair and really get out there and get the word out about my business? I don't have time to go out and pass out flyers. Um, I don't have someone else to do it for me, so what can I do? That is an easy answer and there's a quick fix or easy solution to it. Basically, the internet. Uh, internet marketing for our industry is one of the best things you can do. Not only is it inexpensive, but you can manage it on your own time. You can even outsource it to someone else who can manage it for you and keep everything on track. Um, some of the top ways to market your business that I find that are free is number one, online classified ad sites. I know you've heard of Craigslist. It is the largest classified site out there. But there are hundreds of sites. Have you heard of Backpage, Kijiji, Rain, Facebook Marketplace? The list goes on and on on how many classified ad sites are out there. And all you have to do is find them, uh, upload your ad, and post, I would say, on a consistent basis, at least three times a week. That way your information is steady getting out there. The great part about online classified sites is that not only Typically, can you put in your website address so it links back to your website so people can check you out, but it helps with Google search engines. I mean, that stuff gets ranked. So when people type in, let's say your, your ad is hairstylist in the Fayetteville, Georgia area. <clears throat> when people type in that word or that keyword in Google, it's likely, it's a very high chance that your ad will show up on the first page, if not the second page. That's pretty awesome considering you didn't pay anything to get that type of ranking. Another great source, of course, is Facebook. If you're not on Facebook, you got to get on Facebook. I know so many times we don't want to mix our personal and our business together, but I'm here to tell you, once you decided to open your salon or be an independent stylist or a booth renter, you basically said, hey, I have to do whatever it takes to stay in business, and Facebook has to be one of those things. The great part about Facebook is that it connects you with all of your clients, your existing clients, future clients, and friends. You can also set up a fan page for your business and direct all of your customers over to the fan page. The great part about the fan page is almost like a mini website. Um, you can have your online appointment scheduler connected to your fan page. You can run specials, discounts, coupons. You can do all types of things, but the best part about Facebook is that your friends, your clients, your future clients have friends. The average Facebook user has about 130 friends. So if you ask them to repost their before and after picture of their hair or spread the news about this special promotion you're running, imagine how many people are viewing that. If you had 30 people, let's say at 130, with each with 130 friends, you're talking about over 3,000 people seeing, seeing your ad. That's pretty awesome. The other thing you can do, of course, is set up a Twitter account. Twitter is great for sending out specials and promotions, letting people know any types of deals. It's a great way to communicate as well. LinkedIn, LinkedIn um, is great for our profession. I find it to be more useful in the sense of networking with other professionals in our industry. Uh, it's a great resource for education. If you're trying to branch off into the education sector of this industry, LinkedIn is a great way to get connected. You know I have to tell you how-to videos. How-to videos, trust me, is it can increase your business phenomenally. Um, how, to, how to do a, a French parade or how to wrap your hair or how to put this color in or how to do that. People love that. People love that on YouTube. It's proven and it works. The great part about how-to videos is that you can spend a few hours doing a how-to video on whatever model you're working with and that video will keep giving and giving month after month year after year because there's always new people searching for things on the internet on how to do this or how to do that and so when you do a how-to video you look like the expert you look like the person who knows what they're doing so people will call you 
So how-to videos, hands down, one of the best things you can do. Another great marketing tip that's free is blogging. Blogging can take time, but it draws traffic to your website. And if your website is only being seen by your existing clients, that is not enough. The purpose of a website is three things. To get more appointments, get, um, to get leads, meaning the contact information of people visiting your site, and then to sell retail product. If it's not doing one, two, or three, all of those things, what is the purpose of you having a website other than you want a pretty face online? I say let that go. Your website needs to be working for you. It needs to be drawing traffic. And one of the best ways to do that is to create a blog. A blog to Google is awesome because they love fresh content. So whenever you're out there blogging, that's new fresh content that goes out on the search engine that helps you with your ranking. Uh, of course, last but not least, if you haven't done this already, you need to make sure you list your business with Google Maps not just Google Maps, but Yahoo has a map, Bing has a map, MSN, all of these search engines have maps. And when you list your business, meaning you list your, the name of your business, you can put your telephone number, your address, all of those things show up in the search engines when someone is typing in, you know, hairstylist Fayetteville, Georgia, you know, or salon um, North Carolina, let's say Charlotte, North Carolina. When someone types that in, those maps pop up with different salons. So why miss out on an opportunity to have people to find your business when all you have to do is just register? So I hope these tips have been really good. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, you know I'd love to hear from you. Just leave them down below and I'll respond to you ASAP. Again, I look forward to speaking with you and um, I hope this has been great. Check out our website at salonbusinessmarketingtools.com forward slash secrets. Uh, we have some awesome, awesome products for you to try out that's absolutely free. And if you want to know the secrets to really being successful in this business, check it out. Talk to you later. Bye.